guys, welcome to Best or Hot Mess. I'm your host, Maya McCann, and this is the only show where we test things that we find on the internet to see if they're the best or a hot mess. Um, this week is really exciting. You may have noticed that my hair is a little bit more, um, I don't know what you would call this, like unkempt, uh, disgusting, crazy, bizarre than usual. That is because we are trying the digital hair straightening brush. This is a product by Asa Vivi, Acha Vivi, S Vivi, S Vivi, Ace Vivi. I don't know, if I'm saying this wrong, uh, give me a thumbs up, because I probably am and I, I like those likes. But anyway, we're trying this digital hair straightening brush, so check out what it's supposed to do, and then I'm gonna try it and show you if that's true. I don't think it's changing. Ow! That's hot. <laughs> that's hot. It's like 400 degrees. <laughs> Shh. I thought I heard sizzling. Okay, here we go. Ow. Whoa. Oh, it's steamy. Wow, Steph, that's really straight. So, okay, if that's if that's how it really works, you guys, I'm completely excited. So I've turned this on. It's right now it's at 180 degrees C which, oh, whoa, I can turn it up. I'm turning it up. All right, so now we're at, can you guys see that? Like 195, I think. 185, whatever. It doesn't seem to want to go any hotter. Um, I can feel the heat coming off of it. So I'm just gonna try it. So here's a beautiful lock of my bleach damaged hair. This is what happens, ladies and gentlemen, when you do an ombre, but you don't pay a lot of money for it. So I'm just gonna brush through, oh. Okay. Now you guys, I'm just using this as if it's a, I don't have any, I also should preface this by saying, I am not using any product because I never do anything right. Um, they do recommend that you straighten your hair with a little bit of product in it. I do use a lot of deep conditioners because my hair is so damaged, so maybe like there's residue on there. But so far I'm just brushing it and it seems to be working. The brush is now at 200, but that's pretty straight. The only problem that I'm having with this is that my thumb keeps hitting this, but let me keep going. So let me try it over here so you see this is all the other thing I will say is that I'm not getting like the sleekness that I would get from conditioner but you know what I feel like I feel like I need I feel like I need some product that looks right okay so this is I, I don't know this is some product that I bought at the drugstore because I refuse to buy anything but this is what I put in my hair sometimes before I straighten it it's just like a conditioner so hopefully this will make it like um, a little bit smoother when I burn it. That's what we're doing is we're burning the hair straight. I mean, let's, let's be honest, this is not healthy for your hair. And anyone who tells you that any straightening process is, is just lying to you, which is, it's totally fine. I mean, a lot of people lie, men lie. Uh, your parents lie to you when you're a kid. Santa Claus and whatnot. Or if any children are watching, Santa Claus is real. I don't want to be the one to break the news. Um, so here we go. This is this is helping. Th that's it. We figured it out. You have to use product. Is this a miracle? I okay. Here's the thing, though. My gross hair, my gross fried hair, is getting all caught. That doesn't happen. Do you see that? That's disgusting. But my hair is straight. It's pretty straight. This is not as flat as I would like it. So I'm gonna to try to see if this can super flatten it. How do you guys wear your hair? Are you into super straight? Remember in the 2000s when it was like, how flat can I get my hair? And I remember, I'm old, so I remember being in college and having this flat irons that were, my flat iron I think was as wide as this and I would just stand in the hallway of my tiny dorm room and make sure, like I wasn't happy unless my hair sizzled and there was smoke coming out of it. That's how much I've damaged this head of hair. 
Um, so that's, I feel like this is where I would stop. What do you think of the digital hair straightener? You know what, let's actually, through the magic of production, Sonia, Sonia, can you put a picture of me before and can you put after? I'm posing for Sonia. So, I mean, I think that's it. Like that's all there is to this product. Um, it seems straight, it worked, it wasn't terrible. I think this took me about five minutes, which is insane. Um, usually the front part of my hair takes me at least, I guess, 10, I don't even measure. Usually I don't finish, I give up and I go with like half a straight head. So uh, in the case of the digital hair straightener brush, the best.